lot of feel good, a lot of freedom day, and welcome back. This is Expresso, and our next guests are from a community organization in Cape Town called Project 021, which aims to develop and promote the arts within the Cape Flats. Now, today they have a special stage production. That's right, today they woke up mm. on the same day they have a stage <laughs> production. They woke up for you, which is so, so powerful. Uh, the production is called Given to Fly, and mm. this is uh, set to showcase at the Joseph Stone Auditorium in Athlone in Cape Town. It promises to be a thoroughly entertaining, high energy production which talks about dreams, mm -hmm. uh, hope for a better life, and the disappointments met along the way. Just in time for Freedom Day, we have uh, David Knalsen, the founder of the Project 021 movement, I'm going to call it, along with the crew of the stage production and given to fly Tiffany Ball is here, as well as Alex Clarkson joining us in studio and on our couch. Everybody! Yeah. Welcome! <laughs> Why would you. you wake up so yeah. early on your production day? Doesn't matter. Yeah. It's just happy to have we you. Yeah. It's cool. So, <laughs> let me get it right. So, it's Alex and Tiffany yep. and David. Let's That's start us. with you, David, because okay. Project 021, for anybody who's been under a rock and hasn't been sort of out there scanning the social media sites yeah. to find out a bit more, what's the gist of your organization? The gist, call is really um, creating opportunities for kids to showcase their creative talents, you know? Yeah. Um, Many kids don't have that opportunity and it seems like just a far, far away dream for them to perform on a stage, be part of a show. Um, so we kind of try to bridge that gap okay. to allow kids, young people, and sometimes older ones as well, to come and be part of something where... Because we've got some seriously talented kids in our communities, you know. I can tell. Yeah, <laughs> they don't always know where to go, so we, we kind of created that yeah. environment for them to grow in their creative skills as well. That is so cool. And I can tell that, you know, the arts themselves, it's about yeah. expression, but also it creates uh, opportunities for emotional intelligence for so many exactly. people dealing with things. You now have a script to showcase emotion, feel it and understand emotion. That's what actors do, which is so powerful for anybody who comes to terms with some of the struggles on the Cape Flats. Uh, so this is a powerful movement, but for anybody who wants to see Given to Fly, Tiffany, I'm gonna ask mm. you because uh, I, I would love to know just a bit of a taste bud tantalizer as to why mm. we should come and watch if there are any tickets left. Mm. What is Given to Fly all about? So, Given to Fly is um, a stage production yeah. set in the heart of Marienburg. Okay. And so, Brenda, Sydney, and their five daughters make up the Jacobs family. Uh, their five daughters are, you know, faced with so many challenges which they need to overcome. And um, Sydney, as much as Sydney tries to protect their family, there's only so much he can do as a dad. And, you know, the five siblings are raised to norms and standards that are uncommon in the area. And so for that reason, they are known as the Sturvy Girls in the community. Uh-huh. Yes. Sturvy <laughs> Girls. Yeah, yeah. So that is just the gist of what Giving to Fly is about. That is not all. Okay. That's just, yeah, a drop in the ocean. Mm. A dro no, that's good. I, I just wanted to give us that. A little mm. synopsis is enough for us because now yeah. we're thinking, okay, what, what happens next? But, um, Alex, let's go to you now because you're part of uh, Project 021 and you're part of this entire thing. Uh, tell me a bit more about, like, what do you think it would do for people on the Cape Flats? People who are uh, bored after school, don't really have direction. <laughs> what has this organization done for you and for many of your friends? Well, personally, for me, it's really given me um, a space to be creative and be out there and to, you know, feel comfortable because I love acting and it's what yeah. I want to do with my life. So being able to be a part of it has been amazing to be able to express myself in that way. And I think it will just help also this production bring awareness to what happens in our communities and to, you know, um, help our communities in the future yeah. and to also let young people know that they can be out there and be creative and do something fun and out of their comfort zone. Maybe the struggle is the centre of our creativity. Maybe every single time we are faced with strife, that is our potential for a solution. And it can be an entertaining solution through your project, David, which is so, yeah. so, so great. Is that the dream, to make this a movement of people who are not scared of where they come from, not yeah. sad about where yeah. they come from, it's... but they are proud, even of the struggles yeah. from where they come? Definitely, definitely, um, Carl. I think a lot of the things that we face yeah. um, and the environmental factors uh, contributes to the person you become. Yes. Um, yeah. uh, so there, there are social ills, you know, there are stuff that happens to us, but we also have a destiny. You know, so the things that, that we face, the things that we go through, um, 
creates a character that's unique to the place you come from. Yes. Um, so this is why we love where we come from, you know, because <laughs> because there's a spiciness about where oh, we come from. Yes. There's, there's a character that that's developed in the in people that go through struggles. Yeah. And it's part of what we want to show through the show as well, you know. And I can feel that from from all of of, of the you know the cast members. Yeah. Two of them already. I can tell there's super talents here. Yeah. I'm assuming Tiffany, are you one of the five daughters? Yes, Tiffany? I am. Okay, um, one of them. Okay. I am Tiffany, and I play the role of Samantha Jacobs. And Alex, are you? I play um, the role of Deborah, who's the younger sister. She's the baby of the family. Oh, this is going to be yeah. so cool. <laughs> uh, big one, are there any tickets left for anybody who's interested to go to the Joseph Stone uh, and Athlone Cape Town today? But they can check, Carl, and the last time I checked on, on web tickets, there were very few left, yes. but that's the place to go to check if there are still seats available. Yeah. Great stuff. Alex, thank you so much. Tiffany, thank you so much. David, yeah, thank you. you. It's been an absolute pleasure. If you want to find out more details, please go and Google Project 021, join up, be a part of a community movement, taking the arts to the next level and making individuals proud from where they come.